Hello, you're watching the Calvary Fellowship Weekly. I'm Jessica, and I've got just a few things to share with you. First up, we have a message from one of our missionaries. Katie Van Buskirk is a member of our congregation and a full-time missionary that Calvary Fellowship supports. While Katie's in town, we're going to be having an open house where she will share an update of her missions work this year with a ministry called Ethnos 360. Hey Calvary, looking forward to seeing you guys soon. Just like to say thank you in person for your support and give you a little bit of a ministry update about how things are going in child care. Obviously, we're under a little bit of construction right now, so my project this summer is to finish and update these rooms, um, and I'll be sharing more with you about that soon. See ya! The open house will be Thursday, June 14th from 4 to 7 p.m. Cindy Bartell will be hosting this at her home, so contact her for directions. This summer is going to be loaded with fun ways to connect with others here at Calvary Fellowship. One of those ways is to support our church softball team, the Heavenly Hitters. Games are played at Samuel Homestead Park, and our first game is Monday night, June 4th at 6 p.m. Come out and support the team. This Saturday is the men's breakfast. Join the men of Calvary at 8 a.m. in the youth room for worship, teaching, and breakfast. Bring food and come hungry. Next, here's Dallas to tell you about a new missions opportunity right here in our backyard. Recently, God put on my heart a passion to live out my faith and give as Jesus did. It's so easy for us to become consumed with our own comfort, and it can even become a barrier between us and God. So I wanted to give you a tangible opportunity to focus on the character of God, which at its most basic is a heart for the lost. We're going to partner with the Kitsap Rescue Mission in Bremerton, not only because of their desire to meet the physical needs of the people, but equally the Christ-focused spiritual needs as well. James 5.20 says, Whoever brings back a sinner from his wandering will save his soul from death and cover a multitude of sins. Many of these people are held captive by the system and their addictions to heroin and meth. They really need to know that there is a God who cares for them right where they are and that they can overcome this challenge by His grace. We often view missions as a life-disrupting commitment that takes us halfway across the globe, but the reality is there is a mission field right in our backyard, and it can be as simple as meeting the needs of the poor. Romans 12, 12 through 13 says, Be joyful in hope, patient in affliction, faithful in prayer, and share with the Lord's people who are in need. Practice hospitality. There's a lot we can do, but let's start with this simple act of feeding the homeless. Join us next Sunday after service as we prepare sandwiches to donate to Kitsap Rescue Mission in Bremerton. And finally, here's Anne with your Basque Word of the Week. Hey, so your Basque Word of the Week is Omlo, and it means well. So we use it like this. How are you? Omlo. That's all I have for you this week. Be sure to follow us online at Calvary Gig Harbor.